Hi, this is JD of Tying It All Together. A quick reminder, supporting my books helps support the videos I create here. Best to you all, and keep tying. For this project you'll need 8 feet or about 2.5 meters of leather cord, a rock, my example is 2 inches or about 5 centimeters in diameter, a lacing fed, and small side cutters. Starting with the back side of your rock, place one end of your leather cord top down across the rock spine. Be sure to let some of the cord end dangle off the bottom. Hold the back cord in place and turn the rock around so that its front side faces you, drawing the working end of cord with you. Then, firmly pull the working end back on itself, generating a bite that ends at the front middle of your rock. Hold the bite in place while you take hold of the tip of your working end. Then, pass the working end under and out the front of the bite, locking the bite firmly in position. Now, pull the working end firmly to the right, around the back of your rock, stopping at the location of the right side bite. Then. Pass the working end under and out the front of the right side bite, locking the bite firmly in position. Pull the working end firmly to the left, around the back of your rock, stopping at the location of the left side bite. Then, pass the working end under and out the front of the left side bite, locking the bite firmly in position. Repeat the same procedure moving back and forth, generating a firmly set stitched line down the front of your rock until the desired amount of rock face is covered. Carefully turn the rock around. All cord lines in the back should be parallel to one another and the dangling cord behind the rock should be covered by all the lines of cord. To lock the tie, pull the dangling cord tight, then back to the right. Use your fid to make a space to the left of the right cord, then pass the working end up and under the parallel cords above. Remove the fid, then pull the cord of the working end tight and back to the left. Adjust the piece to assure all lines are parallel and firm. To complete the piece, use your side cutters to snip the top and bottom ends of cord. Then press the cord tips under the wraps. <laughs> 